capturing his outstanding efforts in the Ministry of Culture, Youth, Sports, Community Development, Social Services, Sustainable Development, Telecommunication, and Information. Welcome to On the Move with Minister Evelyn. Follow as he demonstrates a hands-on approach and gets intimate with the work of all his departments and touching the lives of all. It's time to get On the Move with Minister Evelyn as he embodies the life and spirit of a true servant of the people. There is never a dull moment when you are on the move with Minister Evelyn. So let's go! In this, our inaugural edition, let's start our journey at Rollins Village, where Mr. Nathan Neville Sutton celebrated his 99th birthday in January 2020. Minister Evelyn joined him and his family in this milestone event. Let me say good afternoon to everyone who is here and a very special, special good afternoon to the man of the hour. I like how Jeff called him. He's the dedicated and committed soldier. Because of course all of us know Neville many, many years ago when he soldiered around Nevis, especially in Gingerland, to bring the word of God. Yeah. And we heard him today in church. He indicated that it was, he was not alone, but the others have gone. And God has kept him for a purpose. Yeah. I'm always very excited when I go to these um, functions to celebrate our seniors. And I'm always extra excited when I'm in Gingerland because I always have bragging rights in Gingerland because it seems as though Gingerland is the capital of longevity. Gingerland is the capital of long livers. And we're here today because Neville is 99 not out. Our seniors are special and they were made to feel that way on Valentine's Day of this year. Minister Evelyn was on scene at the Jessops Community Centre to show our seniors with love. Good morning, children. Good morning. How are you all doing today? Everybody's doing okay? Now eat your cereal, said her mom. Yuck, shouted Goldilocks. She would never eat anything healthy. So Goldilocks didn't want to eat anything healthy. Just. She wants to eat things unhealthy. Yes, okay. Then her father said, just try it. And he begged her. She said, no, screamed Goldilocks. I want cookies and ice cream, and I want them now. <laughs> now, imagine Goldilocks telling her parents that she wants cookies and ice cream for breakfast.
Let's now head on over to Owali Beach for the closing of the first training of the Swim to Win initiative. Good afternoon to all. It's such a custom now that I'm out every weekend, every Saturday, every Sunday, attending activities and speaking. And it shows that we are doing a lot of things here on the island of Nevis. And we are not only doing a lot of things, we are doing a lot of great things. And the Swim to Win initiative is one of the fantastic initiatives that we are taking advantage of. And I must say how pleased I am that my department of sports is one of the collaborating partners in this initiative and it's good to see what when people collaborate what can happen because what we are seeing from the swim to win initiative initiative is what collaboration can do and we are seeing the results of the collaboration we have seen it over the past month and we have definitely seen it here today where another resident of the St. George's Parish, Mr. Lewis Elliott, celebrated his 99th birthday in February. Can there be sports at Ball Parsha without Minister Evelyn? I say no. Let's journey to the St. George's Recreation Grounds for a piece of the action at the Joycelyn Library Primary School 2020 Athletic Sports Meet.
edition of On The Move with Minister Evelyn. We hope that you have enjoyed this edition and we look forward to seeing you on our next episode. But between now and then, Minister Evelyn continues to forge ahead, empowering and touching lives as he remains on the move.